a sure pathway. That's what we're going to talk about today on Strength for Today. It's Wednesday, February 11th, 2015. Proverbs 21, 29 says, A wicked man hardeneth his face, but as for the upright, he directeth his way. There is no wisdom, nor understanding, nor counsel against the Lord. If you want to walk on a sure road to victory, a sure road to profitability, a sure road to the blessings of God, listen, don't walk away from God. Walk toward Him. Walk in His principles. Walk in His Word. Walk in His way. And you'll never get off the main pathway. You'll always be on the main road. You'll always be heading in the right direction. Why? Because it's a sure pathway. The truth of the Word of God is a sure way to go. The Bible says it. Whether you believe it or I believe it or not settles it. It's the fact that we need to trust His Word. Nehemiah chapter 9 verse 28. There's only one way to succeed in this life. And it's to follow the directives of the Lord. Nehemiah 9 28. But after they had rest and they did evil again before thee. Therefore, leftest thou them in the hand of their enemies, so they could have had the dominion over them. Yet when they returned, they cried unto thee, thou heardest them from heaven, and many times didst thou deliver them according to the mer- thy mercies, and testified us against them, that thou mightest bring them again unto the, uh, to the law, unto thy law. Yet the dealt, they dealt proudly and hearkened not unto thy holy commandments. But sinned against the judgments, which if a man do, he shall live in them. And withdrew his shoulder and hardened their neck and would not hear. Boy, we've got some people who can't get enough of the Word of God. Some of them don't want to hear any of it. We need the Word of God. It's a sure pathway. It's a sure way to write. Don't be stiff-necked and uncircumcised in heart and develop your own way in life. Learn the way of the Word of God. Build your life upon the principles of the Bible. A wicked man whose practices, who practices wicked ways in love and in life, well, in his ways, do the same. And he'll, he'll practice wickedness and hatred instead of love for the Lord. We are by what we, what we go out and practice. We are what we preach. We are what we pray. And folks, listen, we need to pray and preach and live the words of God. And love the words of God. That's a sure path. And he's a, he's a light unto our path. And that's what we need is his light in this dark and dingy day that we live in. May this be your strength for today and your hope for tomorrow.